Hey, this is Clint Sabom, Executive Spiritual Coach for students of Franz Barden, and it's good to be back on YouTube. I know I took a little break there for a while. I had some other stuff I had to deal with, but I am back, and I will be. I will be honest. I know I've made videos in the past that have been critical of Barden. But in all my searching, which spans two decades, in my entire spiritual development, I have never found a better book than Barden's Initiation into Hermetics. In fact, I believe it's really all you ever need. Uh, sure, his future books are great, uh, but Initiation into Her Hermetics, I believe, is all you ever need. It just needs to be gone through multiple times, multiple and multiple times. And what I especially love about initiation into hermetics is that it works towards both self-mastery and spiritual enlightenment. It works both together. So it's a completely integrated teaching and the philosopher's stone becomes a complete integration of self and enlightenment, as well as an integration of really your entire life. And Barden goes through a whole lot of material really fast. I mean, he goes through and covers material that people write five books on in really just like two pages. And so it's very, very dense, you know, and it's almost as if, well, not even almost as if, each sentence matters. Each sentence contains in it something that has been written about, books and books and books have been written about. So it's very dense. And I believe there is no true timeline on this. And I believe that even if you have been working on yourself a lot and you begin this work, it's still going to take some time, years, maybe multiple years. And when I say it's still going to take some time, I mean time to perfect, time to really get down, um, you know, everything and to really master everything. And so I wouldn't put necessarily any timeline on it. I would consider it a life's work. And my suggestion to newer students coming to Barden and being really, really interested is, and Barden doesn't suggest this, but I would suggest it in 2022. It was uh, a bit, a bit, in the past when he wrote this, I would suggest reading the entire book before you even start working the exercises. Then work the exercises, and even if you don't master them, go on to the next one anyway and continue to work the exercises. And just, the book is actually so powerful that even just holding it in my hand, I can feel the energy coming through it. And even just reading it almost kind of starts working on my unconscious and auto-suggestion automatically. So it starts working on me just reading it. You know, the book in itself is um, something you could liken to a spell or a um, self-generating um, alive book, you know. It's, it's a book that's actually alive. You can read it and it will, it will actually just begin to work on you then. So that's been my experience. And, you know, I would just do a rinse and repeat, you know go through all the exercises, re read the book all the way through, go through all the exercises, rinse and repeat. Read the book all the way through, go through all the exercises, rinse and repeat. And it doesn't have to be done perfectly. In fact, you're not gonna do it perfectly. 
it's at such a high level, even a higher level than I would say some of the gurus out there now are at, you know. Um, that That's how powerful I think it is. I think it goes to enlightenment and then beyond, you know, into the next phase. So it's, it's not just, a, you know, become a yogi and do your simple teachings of, you know, um, dissolving the ego or integrating the ego and, you know, remaining in the presence of God all the time. I mean, Barden almost goes over that very, very early in, in the book. So um, those are my thoughts at this point. And it has changed over time, but I'm fully on board with Barden and I would love to help others. And, um, you know, I'm very grateful that people are getting interested in it these days, and there's a renewed sense of interest. And, um, yeah, thanks to all for listening, and I'm gonna be doing a lot more videos in the near future about Barden. All right, many blessings to you wherever you may be. Get the book and get started. Peace.